Hi everyone, I in this video I've just come across basically it's a Tamron 17 to 50 millimeter f2.8 review. Now everybody who's been a subscriber of mine for a while will say John you've already done that review thanks but no thanks. Actually no I've not. This lens that I've got now is the unstabilized version so it's the standard Tamron 17 to 50 f 2.8 no VC on it the one I've got's got VC on it now he's quit photography and he's brought both of these lenses down to me they're like brand new there's a Tamron 70 to 300 the same as mine which a friend of mine's already having so that's gone and there's a 17 to 50 um, well there was until I've seen how well it performs I'm gonna keep it myself um, a Tamron 17 to 50 f 2.8 unstabilized version now it's a little bit noisier at focusing than the stabilized version and it feels a little bit cheesier in the round but watch this I went out this morning and I decided to take a shot at f2.8 because I'd heard that the unstabilized version was quite a bit sharper at f2.8 and f3.2 so I thought I'd try this so I went out and first of all I put my friend's lens on these are unedited out I don't know why that's showing that there's no sharpening on or anything no there's no they're just basically the lens correction that I've enabled if you press the tilde key and you'll see that's all I've done and um, let's just see the lens correction on the unstabilized about same yeah so what I did is I put his lens on my camera and I took a shot 17 mil at 24 at 35 and 50 I never moved and I took all those shots center focus point uh, I didn't even recompose um, so you can see he's banging the center so 17 24 35 around 35 50 then I did it with mine 17 25 35 and 50 so if without further ado just look at this right so this is his lens at 17 mil zoomed in tack tack sharp really sharp now let's go to press the compare key and go to the one on the left so you'll see oh no that's not right oh no hang on, if i know what i'm doing i'll let you know later so what's going on here 17 and will the compare at last there you go we'll get there now look on the left and look on the right now i know there's people going to jump in and go it's misfocus mate as the uh vc version and and it has it it has slightly missed but i don't know bloody why because he was stood right in front of me very close it shouldn't and to be honest that's about what it's like at f2.8 anyway sometimes you can get it slightly sharper but but look at the difference f2.8 on the cheaper version the unstabilized and f2.8 on the vc my lens which i own now um uh, don't get me wrong if i probably took three or four I, I might have got one but that's one thing i've noticed on the vc version it misses focus a lot especially at 2.8 it tends to be okay other apertures but at 2.8 it misses so anyway um without further ado let's take the c key off let's go to the next one is this zoomed in must be yeah so now you can i mean look at how sharp that is at 24 look at his cheeks man it looks like i've over sharpened it i haven't touched it right so now let's press the c key and go to the 24 mil on the right there you go 25 mil can you see you see the difference don't get me wrong he, he must have been I, I had to come upstairs and get each lens so that even though he looks he must have just been slightly further away on the vc but again 70 uh, 24 mil from the cheap unstabilized at two, these are all 2.8 by the way and if you look at the stabilized version it's just missed crap not as good at 2.8 so we'll now do 36 mil shit look at that 
I mean, that is the dog's gonads. I mean, that is like, woo, damn. Can you see it? I'm keeping this lens. <laughs> I'm not, I won't dream of getting rid of it. Anyway, let's press the C key. Let's move across to 36mm on the right hand side. Oh, we're, st we're slightly getting there now. But look again. Still, not even at 36mm. I'm telling you now, that, that, that f2.8, that cheaper version, is like f4 on the, 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 the VC. And by the way, I sent that 17 to 50 VC to Tamron three times for a change. Because I noticed that f2.8 is fine at f4. You'll see it in a minute. They're on par with each other once you open it up a bit. Uh, stop it down a bit, should I say. Get it right. Look at, look at f2.8, man. <laughs> That's amazing. That is absolutely like... Just amazing. 50 mil. Zoom the hell in. Look at that. 50 mil f2.8. Press the C key. Move across to 50 mil on the right hand side. And bang. I wouldn't say there's a great deal in it there, but again, if you look at that eye and that eye, the it it's definitely better again. It's not a thousand times better, but it is. I'd say about Maybe 15-20%, but 15-20% to us togs is uh, not to argue about. So if I take the C key off again, I finished off on my lens. Right, then I stayed on my lens and I opened it up to F4, stopped it down to F4. And you can see, look, I mean, but basically if you look at that F4, the f2.8 on the others as sharp as that. So that's my f4 on my 17 to 50 VC. Press the C key. Let's go across to 1 to 35 mil, don't we? I went reverse on these for some bloody unknown reason. Right, there you go. So, there is my version and there is the cheaper version. And again, it's it's marginal now. They're more or less about the same really are about the same um i said i said to you for but f2.8 and 3.2 is where the difference is phenomenal i'm um, just putting my glasses on yeah definitely i mean the one on the left actually the vc version might look a shade sharper to be honest but it could be that it's slightly more zoomed in than the other one it's slightly closer up so we'll just take that off um, ah, well, we'll do it like that. 35mm on the VC. 35mm on the... Yeah, they're, they're about the same then. I, I couldn't... It'd be really hard to tell that. Um, so we've got... Then we've got 25mm at F4 on the VC. See, look, it's missed as that. That's definitely not going to be the... Um, this next one, I know it ain't. Here we go. Now, look at it. The one on the right is the cheap version. F4, by the way, just a minute. The one on the left is the VC. So it's just been whooped again. Now let's go to 17mm at... Oops, sorry. 17mm F4. And then that should be... This one, should it not? Oh, no, you did it a little... You did it reverse, champ. Hang on, 17mm F4. <sighs> 50mm, 36mm, 17mm, right. What? Just hang on, I'm on drugs. Right, 17mm F4. Zoom it in. Let's press the C key. And there, oh, there you go. Right, look. So again, the one on the left, the VC, the one on the right, the unstabilised cheaper version. It's beat it again. They're both on the same body on the 60D as well. Um, so we finish off at 50mm F4 on the VC. Nice and sharp, that. Um, and then we compare it, and it should be... The one on the right. Uh, no, it's changing that. Don't do that, John. So that's the...
Ah, there you go. Sweet. Yeah. 250 mils at F4. One on the left, the VC. The one on the right, let me just check the numbers. 249. Yep. The one on the right is the... Un In fact, I'd say the VC took that there. The VC version looks sharper. So, we've got the 50 mil... I'm confusing myself. <laughs> we've got the 50 mil... VC, VC lens, and I'll just click on the unstabilized cheaper version, and they're about the same. But if you go to like there, which is there, that's the cheaper version. Um, and then we go to say it might be there, or there, what's that one? There you go, cheaper version, dearer version. <laughs> you see the difference. Cheaper version. Look at that cheaper. Basically, that, that cheaper lens. I, I have read on the internet that people said it was a, a sharper lens. Do you know what I mean? But, um, to be in all fairness, I never really... I wanted the sta the image stabilisation. Um, just in case I'm shooting in weddings and stuff at 60th and 50th of a second. But, looking at how sharp this is at f2.8... And, and how, I mean, just how fantastic it, I mean, it really is as sharp as F4 on my dear one, if not 5.6. Um, so I, I hope this helps and I'm definitely keeping the lens. I don't know, I might, I'm going to leave it on my camera for a bit. And if I, if I can handle it at 50th and 60th of a second or even 30th, which I usually can, um, if I can do that. I'll actually keep it and get rid of my other one because there's no point having two identical lenses. But if not, I'll have to keep the pair um, and I'll use the VC one in really low light when I need the when I've got to handhold it. And I'll use the other one, especially for f two point eight. It just nails. I mean, them shots you've just seen at two point eight, every one of them were razor sharp. It didn't miss once. Like that 17 to 50, don't get me wrong, it is slightly sharper at 2.8 when it nails it, but it misses focus more than it gets it at 2.8. Anyway, I hope this video helps, and thanks for watching, and I'm doing a wedding on Friday, um, so I'll be putting this 2.8 through its paces.